All right, Hillary Glenn, uh, addressing supporters and uh, fundraisers in San Francisco uh, right now. Uh, in that state, uh, she's got a double digit lead. She has uh, big leads in a lot of the battleground states as well. That could change, but for now, it seems to favor. Where that magic is not working, for the time being at least, is in the state of Utah, which normally is a runaway Republican state, uh, goes to the Republican standard bearer, but is far from a gimme now. I want you to take a look at these polls and notice this fellow with the 20 percent. His name is Evan McMullen. He is a rock star in that state. I'll explain in a second. For now, let's go to him. Independent presidential candidate Evan McMullen. Sir, very good to have you. Neil, great to be with you. All right. Now, you're a Mormon. Uh, you know, you're well known in, in, in Utah. Those things matter. You're also benefiting, it would seem, from a lot of the Publicity that Mr. Trump has gotten over tapes that have offended a lot of Utah voters. But there's got to be something more going on here um, because that's a pretty impressive number. What, what is it? Well, I would say it is impressive, and we're very uh, humbled. I'm very humbled that the number is what it is. We're pulling at 20 or 22 percent. Uh, but, but the reality is, is that my name ID in Utah is only 52 percent. And so we've got plenty of room to grow. We're finding that when people hear our message, uh, they, they tend to, to, many of them come on board and join our cause. So, uh, so that's what's happening here. But, you know, people are looking more closely at the candidates as we approach Election Day. And they're not liking, especially here in Utah, what they're seeing in Donald Trump. People well, here how would are you feel, though, that, I'm sorry, but how would you feel if, you know, the, the rap against third-party candidates, if that they are active spoilers? You would be... Uh, you know, high percentage spoiler, but that's in the end what role you might serve tipping that, this state, Utah, oh, to Hillary Clinton. So. What do you make of that? Well, the Constitution allows me to run for the presidency of the United States, and that's exactly what I'm doing, Neil. I'm a candidate like they are, and it's a three way race in Utah between Hillary Clinton, Donald Trump, and me. And I believe with the support of, of Utahns that we can prevail here and that we will prevail. Uh, so that's what this is about. If anything, Donald Trump is a spoiler for conservatism. He's a spoiler for the Republican Party. It's terrible that here in the state of Utah, he's backed by hundreds of millions of dollars and the RNC, the Republican Party in general, and he can't even beat Hillary Clinton decisively. So that's, that has, that's on him, not on me. I'm the only conservative in this race, and I'm standing for principles that this country was founded upon and that are key to our future. And a lot of people here in Utah and elsewhere, especially in the Mountain West, see that and want to support it.